This is Brunei and it's this tiny country here in South Asia. It's fully implementing Sharia law. The death sentence for adultery and gay sex. Punishable by death. Capital crimes. But the all-powerful Sultan of Brunei, one of the richest men in the world, praised his legal system, saying Brunei is a fair and happy place. We had no intention in making this video, but recently we have had a lot of hate comments and a few people ask your opinion. As you guys know, uh, Brunei has just implemented phase two of Sharia law. So here we are to clarify a few things. First of all, we've been volunteering for the past two months that we've been here. We've been volunteering, we've been exploring the country, getting to know lots of different people, different cultures, different ethnic groups. We've done it all. That's the main reason we came to Brunei, to get to know the country and its people and the culture. We made a ton of new friends. Yeah. So that's one of the reasons as well that we've been extending uh, our stay here. So Brunei implemented Sharia law uh, first phase in 2014. And now just recently on the 3rd of April has uh, implemented phase two. So what does this mean? Uh, it means that uh, people from the same sex uh, if they get caught during intercourse, um, they'll get stoned to death. But it's not just like that. They have to be caught during the act by four reliable Muslim witnesses. Then they go to court and then the judge will decide if they get punished or not. That's really impossible uh, to get convicted on if you do it in public. <laughs> no Muslims would have to respect the law and be discreet. Uh, Brunei also has English common law and that's what they base their convictions on most of the times or all of the times really. For non-Muslims and they've got Sharia law for Muslims. Exactly. Non-Muslims have to respect the Sharia law as well but at this place I don't think they will get convicted under the Sharia law as it only applies to Muslims. We are just here, we are traveling, we are getting to know a new country and that's it, that's really it. That's yeah. not, we are not here because we support the law or any other things, we are just here to get to know the country. And there's a lot more countries with Sharia law that I'm sure some of you guys have visited like Egypt, Indonesia, Malaysia. These, some states of Malaysia. Yeah, some states of Malaysia. And in these last three countries, people have been convicted in public not the same as Brunei. Brunei hasn't convicted anybody, especially in public. Hopefully it won't happen. An unrelated man and woman who were seen allegedly being affectionate with each other in public are caned in Indonesia for violating Sharia law. The pair and four others were punished at a mosque in Banda Aceh December 28th. So, by some of your comments, it means that you guys visited those countries, so you are supporting the law in those countries as well, and they have Sharia law in those countries, so you are as well supporting the Sharia law there. <laughs> That's what you guys been telling us, that we support this and we are happy and everything. So yeah, and hypocrites. <laughs> exactly, hypocrites. We love Malaysia, Indonesia, we've never been to Egypt. Uh, but it doesn't mean that we always support the laws. I'm sure in your own country you don't support everything. Exactly, and we are only traveling, we are only discovering the world it doesn't mean that we agree with everything that's going on everywhere in every country and if you would only to visit the countries that we agree with everything we would probably not leave the house we, we won't visit any country in the yes. world we probably would leave <laughs> the house in our own country we will have probably to form our own country and live there so i hope you guys understood everything is clarified we are going to continue our positive videos exploring the world and we're going to continue our videos here in Brunei yep. because we're not living <laughs> just because Sharia law was introduced. Uh, we love being here, the country is lovely, the countryside is beautiful, 
the rainforests are amazing and there's a lot more to to it than just Sharia law and no. I think you guys should visit the countries that sometimes scare you because it's not always like the media says and if you guys disagree with us it's only our opinion anyway so everyone is entitled to have one and this is ours so I think let's finish it off all right yeah, I think that's it for now hope you guys are clear and clarified about our opinion and about our thoughts and everything here thanks for watching don't forget to subscribe and goodbye see you on the next video Woo!